and guys oh my god these two perfumes together it's a vibe okay G -L -A -L -O -R. Hey babe, welcome back to my channel. If you're seeing my face for the first time, I hope you don't make it your last by joining the family, of course, if you enjoy the content and love the vibe over here. My name is Temi and I'm a YouTuber based in Nigeria. I upload videos twice a week, Thursdays and Sundays. And for my OGs, welcome, welcome, welcome back. Please don't forget to put on your post notification bell. I don't want you guys to miss any videos. And without further ado, let's just get into today's video. So guys, we have another perfume haul. Um, I have three perfumes matter of fact these ones are not unboxed perfumes this one are box perfumes I got one from Superdrug one from John Lewis and the other one was gifted to me about two weeks ago <laughs> So babes, before you continue watching this video, it's gonna mean so much to me if you can just take five seconds out of your time to give this video a massive thumbs up. That way YouTube will be able to recommend me to other channels and that way the views will grow, the likes will increase and I'll be in the algorithm space with YouTube. And yeah, so the first perfume I have here is Jimmy Choo. Um, this packaging is so pretty i love the croc detailing here the pink and the white and the like guys let me just open it for you guys obviously i already opened it on my youtube channel i mean my instagram page but we can still do a little a little um unboxing um the only thing i just took out from it is just you know the wrappers um so yeah this is so pretty guys this is honestly so pretty but before we get into the nitty-gritty of the perfume what i like about it what i don't like about it let's just let me read the notes for you guys so this is jimmy chu of the toilet and this is a floral fruity fragrance it was it was launched in 2012 um so the top note is pear green note and ginger the middle note is thai rose i don't know if i pronounced that right um the base note is orchid the i mean the middle note is thai rose and orchid the base note is woodsy note and virginia cedar so first of all i love the bottle i love the black and silver cover i love the silver detailing here and the bottle itself it's so pretty it's obviously like really lovely i've got my papers here and first of all let me not lie i've used this perfume um to church yesterday because i'm filming this video on a monday you guys will be watching on a thursday and i used it to church yesterday because i just wanted to get the feel i didn't want this video to be a first impression I wanted it I wanted to be able to tell you guys a little bit about this perfume so um, woo. first of all the opening before I even um, um, before I even check the notes the first thing I did when I sprayed this the notes of here just busted right out like literally that's the first thing I could smell in here it is definitely fruity because you guys know that i love my fruity floral fragrances so this is definitely really fruity it's sweet as well um yeah the pure note is just really really there i wouldn't say this is pop this is i don't i don't i wouldn't think it's woody i mean i've not used it so much enough to know if it's woody or not um it's citrusy i get a bit of you know the citrusy there the dry down of this perfume, because I told you guys I used it to church, the dry down is definitely powdery. This perfume is fresh, definitely fresh. And it's a bit spicy. The spiciness is not overwhelming. It's just, you know, warm, spicy. But sadly, this perfume is not really for me. It's not really my thing. I mean, I do love my floral, fruity fragrances perfumes, but this did not just stand out for me. But on Fragrantica, a lot of people said that it's not long lasting. But I will say, I mixed this last night when I was going to bed. I used this with my um, Chloe Nomad perfume, and guys, oh my god these two perfumes together it's a vibe okay definitely a vibe i loved it so much and i told you guys in my last video that um the chloe nomad 
and uh, did not last for me but with this perfume mixed together this also does not last as well but the perfume mixed together guys literally this morning during morning prayer it was choking me and i did not even over spray it so i would say if you mix if you have chloe nomad mix the both of them together or if you have any perfume you can mix this together with then definitely it's going to last but other than that on its own this will not last and would i be buying this myself probably not maybe if i check out the the edp and i really like it then yeah but personally i wouldn't be buying this only because of the longevity and yeah it does not really stand out for me but i mean i do appreciate it i do like it but it's just not um it's not wow there's no wow factor in this perfume so yeah so babes just a quick one what do you think about this background do you like the one in my last video or this one let me know in the comment section down below because i'm just trying to experiment with my backgrounds and stuff so let me know which one you prefer the last one in my last video or this one so yeah so guys the next perfume i have here is versace is that you pronounce it versace crystal noir this is also edt perfume and i love first of all let's get into the into the packaging i love the black and gold vibe that is going on it's very much versace brand um but yeah so i also unboxed this on my instagram as well so yeah you guys can see the black um here and um yeah this is this is something okay this is humongous this is the cover it's just nah okay anyways let me read out the notes of this one for you guys this is like i said this is an edt perfume and um this is a, a floral fragrance it was launched launched in 2004 um so the top note is violet and black fig black currant jasmine tuberose fragi pani i don't know how to pronounce that sandalwood cashmere vanilla and heliotrope heliotrope guys forgive me how i'm pronouncing this okay english is not my first language all right so um first of all what is going on with the cap of this like i bought this on super drug and um i had a bit of discount as because i have the health and beauty card so i did get a bit of discount and personally they still have like discount going on on super drug if you live in the uk you know all about super drug you know how they do with the discounts and stuff they're really generous and if you have um a health and beauty card as well you'll be able to get more discounts on this so yeah i got this this is 50 ml um you guys know that i've been loving my 50 ml perfumes only because just in case i don't like it i don't want to have to buy a big bottle and i don't end up liking it so i did go in and buy the 50 ml bottle but what i don't like is the fact that on super jog is showing this bottle but they sent this one because this one is supposed to be the 30 ml bottle that's the way that's the picture they put on the website but regardless this is 50 ml now with crystal noir i ain't gonna lie i've used it before and listen guys i bought this based on reviews um i watched a couple of um youtubers um like karina i watched um i can't remember her name that curly scent um i watched just this so I could, guys i don't want to murder names and um what's his name as well jeremy fragrance all of them talked about nice things about this perfume so i thought okay get you know let me get it and so i bought it based on their reviews and guys it did not like listen i love this perfume this perfume is a beast if you are looking for a perfume that is a beast it's this one versace crystal noir is amazing now this perfume is not for everyone i will say having it myself now i wouldn't say it's for everyone i have tried the edp i got the edp for my best friend for christmas and i tried it as well and the edp is more soft more creamy more round whereas this is like more you get the punch because it's not like it's all the toilet so you get the all the toilet punch in this perfume but let me tell you this top i'm wearing I, I believe i wore it last week um two weeks ago where i got the jimmy Choo perfume i sprayed this and my ysl libre 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 however it's called i sprayed both of them together guys i've not worn this this top in two weeks and it still smells like 
I, I brought it out from the hanger and I tried it on guys this oh my god both of them together will have you smelling like a what a rich babe i kid you not listen um so the main accord is woody definitely woody it's powdery the dry down for me is powdery this uh is white floral is floral is fruity vanilla violet tuberose mm, musky and sweet yes it's definitely musky now if you know you know if you know you know i don't like tuberose perfumes i don't like well i don't mind it if i mix it with something but on its own i don't good girl no twilly no listen the tuber is in there it's not properly done but the tuberose in this perfume is properly done it's round like this perfume is amazing it's mind-blowing i definitely love this perfume and I just love me the Versace Crystal Noir and this is aesthetically pleasing well obviously the, the, the cap is humongous but I don't mind it you know it's gonna look really good in the background somewhere I love the bottle as well but it's just the size that is deceiving because when I got it I was like what is this 30 ml but it's well 50 ml is written on there so I, I wouldn't know but I love this perfume okay I love this perfume um mixed together with libre the edp not the intense um and it's listen you are going to smell like a rich babe you're gonna smell amazing babes the last perfume i have here i saved the last for the best the best for the last guys i never know how to say that so this is mongolon by Guolon. this is not a blind buy the other ones I have here, well, the one I was gifted, obviously, apart from that one, Crystal Noir is a bland buy because obviously I bought it based on reviews, but it's still a bland buy because I've never smelt it. But Mongolon, listen, this is a love at first sniff, just as um, the C, Giorgio Armani. This is also love at first sniff. Now, I went to the mall and I was like, okay, I kept seeing a lot of reviews about Mongolon. Matter of fact, yeah, Karina put me on Mongolon, okay? She put me on Mongolon. Um, so when I went to, um, to Essenza, I went to check out the perfumes and I was like, okay, do you know what? Let me test out Mongolon and the intense version. And the initial spray did not really stand up for me. It wasn't really it for me. So that I'm using the, what's it called? The paper that, that sprayed it on. I've had this for like, what? Since last year, December or I think last year September yeah I've had this as a last year September I, I don't know why it's still with me but it came handy okay so they sprayed Mongolan intense in one paper and Mongolan in another paper so I remember like I went about you know shopping and stuff and I was like what is that smell I couldn't put my finger on it if it was Mongolan or the intense version okay but it kept smelling and in the car it, and this was in the bag okay it was not even in my pocket or anything this was in the bag and it kept smelling and i'm like what is this oh my god this smells amazing i have to buy it and i kept checking online but it's expensive okay it's expensive i kept checking online and i was like oh my god i need this perfume like it smells so good and lo and behold i got mine i got it on john lewis i got the 50 ml because 50 ml was a lot obviously cheaper i i can't buy the, 50, the 100 ml but in nigeria a lot of vendors do sell the 50 ml as well so obviously i'm going to be buying another one duh why spend so much on box when i can buy the unboxed one so i'm definitely going to be buying the unboxed one and also the mongolian intense because i love the both of them so this is what this is this looks like and i love the packaging as well very simple gold red black aesthetics and oh guys listen you guys can see that i've used that of it okay i've used that of it um i kind of just mixed it because what i do is i have a decant um the automizer little refill bottle so i just mix bunch of perfumes in there and yeah so 
oh guys listen look at the gold like this is very simple i love me simple bottles and i love dramatic bottles as well just like the versace crystal noir and i love my jimmy choo bottle and i love my c bottle but this is just very simple this is very classic and i believe the face on this perfume is angelina jolie and guys i know i'm talking too much you know i'm not reading out the notes but that's how much i love this perfume so let's just get on with the notes um Mongolian is amber woody fragrance for women this was launched in 24 2017 so the top notes for this perfume is lavender bergamot the medium notes is iris jasmine sambac rose the base notes is Tahit tahitian vanilla coumarin australian sandalwood licorice benzoin uh, guys i don't know how to pronounce it okay and patchouli now i love me my patchouli perfumes i love me my um jasmine perfumes um notes in perfumes and stuff guys this for me is love and fussing so so babies i didn't have a third um paper thing for smelling stuff so i just tore out a bit of paper i just kind of cut it out the same shape as the other one now this perfume is very potent just like the versace crystal noir that perfume is a mad potent okay this perfume is potent so let's just oh hoo, hoo, hoo. hmm the old room is smelling already of what of mongolian if you don't like this perfume if you don't have this perfume in your collection are you even a classic babe are you are you i'm asking you a question are you oh this perfume the initial notes like i said before i don't really fancy it but the midi notes the base notes is what gets me in this perfume i get a bit of mint in this perfume now i don't really know much about all this other like all the notes listed below um but i get a bit of mint like the dry down i get a bit i definitely get a bit of mint from this perfume it is so round it's so beautiful oh look guys my room smells of it right now Ooh, whew. guys i don't even know what to say but let me read out the main accords for you guys because i love it that much so the main accords um is vanilla lavender woody aromatic powdery balsamic sweet warm spicy fresh spicy and iris definitely the lavender i smell the lavender in here is prominent but the lavender in here is so well done like it's so beautiful um i do get the vanilla notes the lavender then the vanilla vanilla notes okay um, this is fresh it's definitely fresh um Ooh. or maybe it's the aromatic i don't know that i'm getting but i, I don't know if you have mongolian let me know in the comment section down below if you also feel like this perfume has gives you the minty a bit just a tiny bit of the mint feeling but this perfume lasts forever i don't over spray it just one two three four and i'm done Le sometimes less than four sprays if i'm in the house i'm not going anywhere I would use like two sprays but if i'm going out i would use four to five sprays and that's it but oh this perfume is amazing oh my god and guys i keep saying the bottle is just very simple and very beautiful um i definitely love it i love the gold detailing here and i feel like the intense version as well is really nice like this perfume i forgot to tell you is really sweet but i feel like the intense version is a lot more sweeter than this to be honest um that's why i need the intense version i need the intense version of mongolian and the intense version of the c georgia armani um i love it i love it okay i love it so much and um yeah so guys these are all the perfumes i have for you guys today if you have any more perfumes you would want me to try um let me know in the comment section down below i'm gonna be coming in with my ysl libre and um c fury because i have that as well so watch out for those two perfume haul that i got as well but that's basically everything and yeah so um guys don't forget to like this video don't forget to subscribe and also click the notification bell comment down below what you think if you have any of those perfumes comment down below let me know your thoughts um let me know what you think about mongolian versace crystal noir the edt one and the jimmy Choo. You definitely want to get the the versace crystal noir um ed 
P because I like the EDP. Um, it's very soft, very round. So let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Don't forget to like this video, don't forget to subscribe, and also click the notification bell. And I'll see you, my babes, in the next video. Until then, stay easy, breezy, and beautiful. Bye, guys. It's a good thing you're smelling my perfume. Don't worry, I'm about to take over. <laughs> oh.